Another legal shakeup. A key White House lawyer representing President Trump in the Russia investigation is leaving. That news comes as the president's legal team tries to hammer out details of a possible Trump interview with the special counsel. A White House lawyer representing President Trump in connection with special counsel Robert Mueller's Russia investigation announced his retirement at the end of the month. Attorney Ty Cobb told CBS News's Major Garrett in January the president is very eager to speak with the special counsel. I think at the end of the day, it's pretty clear that you know, on the collusion side of you know allegations, there is no quid pro quo between the Trump campaign uh, and the Russians. News of Cobb's retirement comes a day after one of the president's former lawyers told the Associated Press Mueller raised the idea of a subpoena during a meeting in early March to force the president to testify under oath. In a tweet this morning, the president once again called the investigation a witch hunt, dismissing claims of collusion as a hoax and obstruction of justice as a setup and trap. A subpoena has always been an option for the special counsel, but to use it on a sitting president would be an extraordinary move. If Mueller indeed issued one, the president could fight it in court. Meantime, Deputy Attorney General Rod Rosenstein, who oversees Mueller's investigation, pushed back against reports Republican lawmakers were drafting articles of impeachment against him. I think they should understand by now the Department of Justice is not going to be extorted. Republican members of the House Freedom Caucus say impeachment would be used against Rosenstein as a last resort. A White House official tells CBS News Emmett Flood will join the White House legal team. The veteran lawyer advised former President Bill Clinton in his impeachment proceeding.